Hello and welcome back to Miss Hewlett's music class. Today is Thursday, which means it is Friday Eve. So exciting. We're almost done with one more week of virtual learning. But today is the last day of our instrument inventions project. So today is the day you get to make your instrument. You get to figure out what kind of sounds you want it to make and maybe figure out what kind of a song you want to sing when you use it. Okay, so that's pretty exciting. I have one more instrument invention that I wanted to share with you, and it is the metal flute, or the flute as we know it today. Okay, so originally the flute came from all sorts of different cultures, but usually it was made of wood. So the transition from wood to metal happened in around the early 1900s by a man named Theobald Boom. Okay, he made the metal flute specifically for one of Cloud Debussy's pieces, and Debussy is a composer. He's fairly famous for his romantic music, okay, and impressionistic music, but he created, Cloud, not Cloud Debussy, but Theo Boom, he created the metal flute as we know it for a specific Debussy piece called Syrinx, but it was so popular that now this flute is made pretty much everywhere. It's used in a lot of concert pieces or in orchestral works, um, and it tends to hold up a little bit better than, than wood. So it's used a lot more now and has a lot more keys that make it a bit easier to create the sounds that we're looking for. So the last thing I wanted to do today is play the song for you that I'm going to do for my video tomorrow. Let's see if you recognize it. And the cool thing about the flute is you can even go up one more octave, which means that it goes higher, okay? The flute was my first instrument that I learned when I was actually in fourth grade, okay? So still a little rusty. My main instrument is bassoon, but here is the upper octave. Okay, that's all the hint you get, but tomorrow I will have a video for you. Until then, have a great Thursday and happy World Kindness Day. Let's see some amazing acts of kindness. 